When I had Chloe in the hospital, everything was absolutely fine. Um, we went home with her and she was fine. And the midwife came when she was a week old to do the heel prick test. The midwife turned up unexpectedly to tell us something had been detected in Chloe's blood to do with her thyroid. And we were shocked, frightened, worried, thinking, oh my gosh, what's the matter with our daughter? Um, but we saw a consultant really quickly and had it explained to us and we were like, okay, it's not as bad as we thought. And yeah, she had blood tests very quickly and the consultant was on it. And within a few days, Chloe was on thyroxin. Throughout my childhood, I've never really felt any symptoms or ever really thought that there was anything wrong with me. Because I don't have like thyroxine in me. It, when I take my thyroxine, it's what keeps me well and stuff. And then if I don't take it, then I might not like have grown as much as I have and might not be me. It doesn't really worry me to have hypo hypothyroidism. When I go to the hospital every six months, I usually just get a blood test. I go to see the consultant about a week after but I've never really had a problem. I think that me taking the medication every day is what makes sure it's got all under control. I do a lot of dancing. I do tap and ballet, and I like tap better. For anybody whose baby has just been diagnosed with congenital hypothyroidism, yes, panic, but don't panic. Um, and ask lots of questions. Never be afraid to ask the questions. Chloe's never missed out on anything. She does everything her friends do. Um, things might change going through puberty, but she's going along nicely as normal. Everything's been fine with my hypothyroidism and hopefully it will stay fine for the rest of my life. And